some people with disabilities that can some, they might not be able to move their arm. And if you can imagine like dressing a small like a child, then he or she might move their arm like very like drastically. Another challenge that we are focusing on is about the human, because we have the the task has the human in the loop, and the human can do many many different things, and it's very hard to predict the human behavior. Our goal is that we can deploy this robot at each every person at home, and uh, hopefully, with a short period of time, the robot can learn to uh, adapt to work with this person. If there is a, a contact between the robot and the environment or the human, which is not expected, the robot can sense this understand that it can be harmful and then alter its motion or even stop.